If I were you, um, I would try a couple. Yeah. There is. I tell you what I think is important for for you to to get out of a foot one is is ground compliance mm -hmm. and even terrains, but also torsion. Yep. And two is energy return. Mm -hmm. On paper, that works really well. Yep. Um, we tried a couple on with a rotate on it uh, um, on people who came from this one and they yep. found it really, really, really soft and flexible. Right. Okay. Because this this curve here continues. Yep. yep. It's it, you, it's kind of like standing a bit on a on a spring. Mm -hmm. So people without the rotator seem to love it. Right. Okay. I've never heard anything bad about this foot. No. Um, this particular one, never, ever. Right, okay. With the Rotate, we've had a couple where we uh, included that yep. and people found it just too much yep. movement. Kind of too much this way? Everywhere, just, you know. So that this one has a bit of this movement? Uh, only what's in the carbon because it's got two blades. Right, so okay. they move yep. against one another from right. that point here. Yeah. From that point right, down. Right, okay, it's okay. not a lot. Yep. Um, I don't think it's enough for transtibial osseointegration, but I don't know. I just don't think right. it is. Okay. I like the, I like the reflex because I like what it's going to offer me, but I yeah. also want a cosmosis. So maybe for that particular foot? Well, I don't think you can put a cosmosis on reflex. It's really difficult to move. Tried a few times. And it's going to squeak. It's yeah. It, it squeaks and it it just. It just cracks here really yeah. quickly, yeah. and it impedes what the foot can do. Yeah. Really, no, I that. Um, they are pain to cosmetically cover as well. Oh, okay. Just because of where that here ends. Oh, yeah. Like if you look at that, you'd actually yeah. your leg would kind of normally finish here. Mm. That's why I'm saying maybe standard, very flex, yep. shock absorber. Yep. The advantage, the disadvantage is you have two parts. The advantage, as opposed to having this with a rotate, mm -hmm. or as a this as a rotate or that one. Yeah. The advantage is it's cosmetically better, and you can the shock absorber as a standalone unit has much more adjustability than this is what it is. Right. Yeah. Especially okay. with the new ones. And if you break one part, you can switch it out. Yeah. As like if you say go for a delta twist or a what's the other one called total shock? Mm. Yeah. You can change the stiffness of the elastomers for vertical travel. Yeah. But also for rotation. Right. Okay. So you can customize them a bit better.